All right, here we go. We have been every week or so coming back to our jump rope here, giving you some tips and tricks. Uh, today, let's talk about how to do a side to side action. Okay, so last time we talked about how to do a cross, which is a quick one, two. This is a little more subtle, which is why it's a little harder for most people. All right, here's the video to practice your side to side, do it without jumping first, like this. You're just going to get used to this feeling. Now, if you look at my hands, you'll see that it's subtle. This arm, my right arm, is doing most of the side to side action. The left hand, I call it the typewriter carriage, that's just passing back and forth. And what this does is it allows you to keep the rope, the parabola, intact. If you were to do both hands side to side, you're going to get something like this. Now it's just like one big string, and I can't jump through that, right? So one hand is crossing, the other hand is just kind of the typewriter carriage. You'll naturally feel one hand wants to be the cross one, usually your dominant hand, so I'm right-handed, so that's my crossing hand, and your uh, not dominant hand is going to be the one that's just doing this. All right, now let's see how to get the jump going. So you're doing this, and go. So you've got the side to side, and then as you come around this one, the crisscross hand doesn't crisscross, it stays here, the typewriter carriage goes back, and now you're ready to jump through the hoop. All right, so uh, it's much easier to practice on one side first, like so for example, I'm always going to go one, two, three, and then jump, rather than trying to do it from over here. Because to do that, you have to actually change the whole typewriter carriage arm, which is complicated at first. You know what I mean? So, one, two, jump. One, two, jump. I'm always doing it on the same side. Okay? And then you can choose to do different things as you do your side to side. So, a little more advanced, but you can have fun with it like this. So, I can do side to side. Where I lunge. Um, I've seen people do like push ups during side to sides, all this kind of stuff. So uh, you have lots of freedom with your legs because you're not having to do a jump. But the smartest thing to get started is to just keep jumping your regular rhythm as you side to side. So jump, 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 jump. So that's how the basics of it. Good luck. Practice. Just start like this. See you next time.